Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Wee Burns Cradle. I have a Walmart box here. Um, remember I was telling you about my inner child wanting to try out that new baby. I, f I think it's a baby born, but I can't remember. Anyways, my inner child wants to open up this baby and see what it's like and see what this is like. So join me as I open this Walmart box. So excited. I put you back onto the wide lens um, and as soon as I open this box, hopefully the light will come in better. But I just wanted to show you that I did purchase this baby from Walmart. And I bought more masks. More masks. Oh, <laughs> he's here. He's actually bigger than I thought. Okay, hopefully. Okay, and don't mind my my jeans i'm wearing jeans today um no blanket or nothing i just want to simply open but this but apparently these are the different things and sorry about the glare you can feed him give him a bottle he cries real tears he pees and poops changes diaper he poses for pics and you can give him a bath and nap time oh he closes his eyes and so far the accessories in there look really interesting this is the back yay i'm so excited oh my inner child is so happy you know i did own some dolls as a child and i did have an interactive crawling baby but i never had the baby alive and to have a, a doll that could, like, have a wet drink system, oh, it was a dream of mine. And now I finally get to honor that dream. Oh, it comes with a pacifier, too. It's so cute. Let's see. Look at this. Look at this really adorable pacifier. Oh, I'm okay, okay. Wait, let me see if I can get the lighting. Not so much of a glare here. Okay, I'll try and get him out. Let's see, try and take out this whole thing. Look at his sweet lips. <laughs> he's cute. And he's actually bigger than I thought. He is definitely bigger than the baby alives. So let's just see what. Okay, how does. That's cute outfit. Now, I'm wondering if, like, regular premium clothes can fit. I see that his pants are up super high. And, actually, oh, he has a boy bit. <laughs> I didn't know he had a boy bit. 
<laughs> That's cute. Oh my goodness. That's wow. I was not expecting. Okay, I will. He has a boy bit. But look, his belly is soft. It's still final. Let's see. Wait, how come this doesn't even fit in his mouth? That's weird. Shouldn't it be able to fit? Look, it's not fitting. Oh, oh. There, look, he can hold on to his own bottle. <laughs> oh, okay, that I had to shove in there, probably because it's like brand new. Oh, it's, oh, it's sweet. I would love to try like a real bottle on him. Oh, he has an impression of hair not painted. Oh my goodness, here they are. He is so cute for a baby doll. He is sweet. And there's his mouth. He's painted. Oh, okay, I just realized his. Yeah. This is soft, like. Oh, he's sweet. I love him. Okay, wait. Um, I see that he has two holes at the bottom. Okay, I'll try and, like, he has, like, two holes. That's interesting. Hmm. Interesting. So, like, oh, his head turns fairly easy. His limbs are hard like a baby alive. Maybe a little bit. I could squish him a little bit softer. Oh, he has good movement. Oh, wow. He has good movement in his arms. His legs have good movement. They can't go up though, but... But I'm surprised his belly is like... I hear air. I think that's how you make him cry. If you fill him up... Uh okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> He's sweet. Okay. These are I also bought these from Walmart. They're not the micro creamy because we don't have the micro creamy in Canada, but we do have the creamy. So I'll open up one of these. That's what they look like. Let's see how big. They're not overly big. So I bet you these would work. Because I also use a preemie on the baby lives. And he is a bit smaller than the baby. Or bigger than the baby lives. Sorry, bigger. I would like to, I love this bottle, but I'm going to try a real one. Look at this cute pacifier. It has something inside. <laughs> Aww. He's cute. And I bet you with that hat, he would look even more cute. Okay. Oh, they fit. They fit him pretty well. Good, because these are a lot cheaper than dull. They fit. They fit pretty good, actually. Wow. I'm surprised his stomach could be squishy. Uh can't wait to try. But the only thing is is that oh wait. Is there even like a why how can you feed him if this this isn't a real bottle? Look, there's no hole. Oops. It was an accessory, I guess. 
was an accessory. Oops. Sorry. Look, it was cute. I don't I don't know if I have any creamy. I didn't I didn't expect him to be here. Oh. Oh, he's cute. So this is a fake bottle. This is a fake bottle. That's discouraging. I would love to feed him like a pretend bottle. I guess that's what this is for. You're supposed to feed him. But I don't like this bowl. It looks like a bed pan. <laughs> I don't think I'd use that, and I don't think I'll use this. So I'll put that in as a vlog bang. This must be fake food, but I know how to make my own. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> I will link a video. I make all my own baby alive food, and it's, and it's, well, I, I say in the video, it will not mold in the bodies because it has a mixture of baking soda. So it's actually a cleaning like there's nothing that will mold because of the baking soda so um anyways i will link how i make baby alive food which i'll probably use for him oh another thing like i didn't see anywhere how we can clean him but let me see if i have some if some clothes will fit i'll be right back the only clothes I could find are Amberly's right now. Um, so this is a Freemy Carter's onesie. It looks like it will fit actually pretty well. And this is one of Amberly's Freemy sleepers. So, um, and I also have a bin here of winter hats. Not the yarn knitted outdoor hats, but the inside hats. But I'll show you once I try this. Oh, his head is big. So, if you can see that. Let's try on this preemie and see if they fit. Like, he is, like, if you have a love of Bella doll, this guy is a little smaller, not too much smaller though. But this preemie Carter's actually fits him pretty well. And I'm disappointed this bottle is not real. Oops, I think I put these snaps on. Yeah, that preemie fits him, like, snugly, actually. Like, it's not too big, not too little. This is how big. Wow. Aw. <laughs> He's cute. I can't believe he can. Okay, let's try on this preemie. I know it's a girl outfit, but that's all I have for now. I I do have boy preemie outfits, but they're they're downstairs right now. Yes, in my hoarder room. Just kidding. In my in my storage room of my it'll be in another bin. I I love these bins. I have a whole bunch of these kind of bins, like lots. So I have a bin for Amberly's things with her belly plate and some outfits for her. But um Amberly is my tink sculpt. Oh this this fits him actually pretty well. So this is a uh preemie. And I hear that my family is starting to wake up. How come this isn't? Did I miss something? Oh, I did miss. There. Aww. 
Yeah, I would love to try like a real bottle on him. So look, this is a preemie. It's so slightly big, but I'd rather have it. Oh, his eyes just opened. So cute. This is a koala bear. Preemie. Koala baby. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, yeah. I I would say that it fits. It fits him. Oh, oops. I try it. I guess with these guys, a paint could. Okay. Look how sweet he is. Pacifier. Oh. I could put a boy in this. <laughs> okay, let's see what kind of hats. These are my. Have it been a bonnet hat, summer hats, a bonnet of winter yarn hats, knitted hats, and then I have these kind of hats, just normal. Okay, so let's see what could fit with this. I would love if I could find a hat with this thing on top. I would love that. That's totally not the right color, though. Have this. These two are similar. One with ears. Oh, I remember. This is one of the first hats I've ever owned for Emily. It's cute. This one goes with, oops, and now fit. Same with this Winnie the Pooh one. Wrong color. You see, I love the light pink. I need something that will match. These are some of the boy. This comes with the outfit that I got from Wendy. Came with Billy. Oh, this one's small. This one's wrong color. Cute, but wrong. Here's a plain white one, maybe. Wrong pink. Wrong pink. This one's cute, but doesn't really match. I love this one. See, that kind. It doesn't really match. All these hats, and it's the wrong kind of pink. Look at this one. Cute. Wrong blue. All these light pinks. Here's a darker pink with black, but it's the wrong pink. Looks small. Here's a brown one. I remember this. It's another blue. Oh, another one. Hmm. Car one. Oh, this is cute. I want one like this, but one will match. It doesn't really match. It doesn't really match. Look at all these hats. Even in burgundy, beautiful. Oh. No, it's not. I thought it was that bonnet. Wait a bug. Purple. I can't believe all these hats and none of them. Here's a plain white one again. And none of them really match. <laughs> this is cute, but it's the wrong pink. Minnie Mouse. Um, I got a lot of these hats from secondhand stores. Where they would be like 75 cents. And some of these I bought, like this one, on clearance. Oh, look at this one. And a lot of these hats came from box openings. Like, Kelly gave me a whole... Most of these are from Kelly, like the ones that I didn't buy. And a lot of these are from Erin. This is cute, but it's the wrong pink. It's the wrong pink. I'm running out. Oh, this is cute. Look at the ears. Wrong pink though. Mini mouse. Actually, it looks kind of cute. What's this? Oh, it's a baby face cloth. <laughs> Washcloth. I have another bear one. A little kitten one. This kind. Okay. I have all of these hats. Should just. 
I have better options with the yarn, the knitted ones, because, okay, because um, they would match a lot more things. The only thing with these kind of hats is that they have to kind of match, like, perfectly. Okay, let's try, these two look pretty much identical. Let's try it. This one looks, can okay, press the arms down. This one looks kind of, I don't know. I don't know. Mm, kind of boring, I think. Same thing, but a bit bigger. Hmm. Okay. Let's try this mini mouse. The red's not exactly like this color, but it comes pretty close. <laughs> it's kind of big. <laughs> oh, we got an eye open. He's like, what are you doing to me? I don't know. Maybe I need a yitted, uh, yitted. I mean a knitted hat but we do know that the preemie I don't know I like the bonnets or a knitted sock hat maybe if I get this is him uh, he's cute okay what was he wearing before he was wearing like this hood. It's like it's like a cape. So yeah, premium works. I wish I hadn't. I shouldn't. My other bin of hats is downstairs. I don't, don't really want to. I guess this is probably the best size for him now. It's not my favorite hat right now, but I wonder if he could just like sit in here, if that could be a seat. Aw, so there he is. Actually, I think I will keep that seat because it's a good place for him to just sit. He won't fall over. It's pretty sturdy. I would love to try like a real bottle on him. This is fake. There's not even a, a hole. So, but this is really cute on him. There's like something in it. It's cute. It's like this on this side. It looks like that on this side. It's cute, Passy, and this must be food. Must be. Yeah. So, anyways, guys, would you like to know his name? I thought when I saw him, he looks like a really cute Elijah, but Eli for short. So, this is Eli. Oh, he's a cute. So, anyways, guys, thank you for joining. And yes, Premi fit him very well, and Premi clothes fit him really well. And one of these days, I would love to see if he can take a real, like a Premi size, like one of those um, 
Like, I do have premium bubbles, but they're not sealed yet, so I'd love to try it on him. So, anyways, guys, hope that you're doing well. Thank you so much for joining, and until next time, bye guys.